Want more of a bird's eye view when building in Fallout 4's workshop? Well stay tuned, because I'm about to show you how to do just that. Hello and welcome to Breaking Tactics, the show where breaking the game is just part of the plan. My name is Zanon, and on today's episode I'll be showing you how to get an isometric view when using the workshop. First off, I need to point out that this trick is only compatible with the PC versions of Fallout 4, as it requires use of the console commands. If you're not familiar with console commands, I recommend reading this link to learn more. I'd also like to advise that you take caution when using console commands, as some have the potential to corrupt saves. The console commands featured in this video, however, have been extensively tested by myself with no lasting effects. So to get started, first, pick an area you want to build in, and then spawn a turret. The turret should be spawned in the direction you want your overhead camera facing. This is important, but I'll get to that in just a minute. Next, while looking in the direction of the turret, activate your VATS and press this button to bring up the developer console. In the console, type the letters T, F, C. This can be in both lowercase, caps, or any variation of the two. Once that's typed, press enter, hit the console button again, and exit VATS. Now with that done, move your camera to the position that you want to build from, open your console, type T, F, C, press enter, and close the console. If you did all that right, you should now be able to move around independently from your camera. Before you start building, however, I should say that it's much easier to build at night. Notice how your flashlight is always on your left side? Remember that. You should also take note of how your character moves. If you place the turret somewhere other than the direction your camera is facing, you may find that your controls are entirely inverted. Now that you're all set up, go ahead and open up your workshop. The first thing you'll probably notice is that your body seems to have teleported to the camera. What has actually happened is that your character model is teleported, but your actual body is still standing exactly where you were. By having your flashlight on and remembering that it is on your left side, you'll have a much easier time navigating as you build. When you are done building, simply enter the command into your console again, find a turret, activate VATS, and then exit VATS. You may find that you have lost the ability to draw your weapon, use your pit boy or sprint, but if that happens, simply save and restart your game. Another interesting thing to note is that your camera remains locked to this position even if you load a save file. This isn't permanent, however, as restarting the game will return your camera to its original position. Well, that's it. If you like this video and want to see more, be sure to like and subscribe. Information on the music used in this video is in the description. And until next time, keep breaking games. Oh. <laughs>